A fistula is an unnatural tube or tube-like connection between an organ or an inflammatory focus and the body interior or the body surface. A fistula is the body's reaction to a chronic inflammation. When one suffers from chronic inflammation with pus formation in a certain location, a pus canal may develop. Pus flows from the inflamed area through this pus canal, which eventually arrives at the body surface or the body interior. A dental fistula is usually felt as a small elevation on the gums. When this elevation ruptures, pus empties out into the oral cavity and the elevation disappears, only to quickly fill up again. This process repeats itself, occasionally resulting in scarring of the existing pus canal. The walls around the pus canal get coated with special cells, following which the body isolates it. This eventually results in a fistula. This patient had a fall many years ago, injuring his anterior tooth. The tooth nerve, or pulp, died without the patient realizing it, and the damaged nerve tissue caused an inflammatory reaction in the bone. Pus made its way to the gum surface, which led to the formation of a small elevation on the gums. This elevation eventually ruptured, allowing pus to flow out. With time, the lesion became more organized, and a fistula course was formed from the bone infection to the mucosa. Although the patient still does not experience any acute discomfort, the infection has literally eaten up the bone, causing the bone defect to grow larger. The x-ray demonstrates the tooth and the bone defect. The inflammation focus empties out via the fistula canal into the oral cavity. Possible treatment options include either a root canal treatment or, if the focus is too large, root canal treatment with subsequent root tip resection. The fistula canal is usually removed during the surgery. If not, it normally heals by itself after the causative factor is removed.